Hey guys, welcome back. This is Ron Jordan over at RJ Lang Sales coming at you with an E95 product demo. Uh, it's a feature set that's gaining a lot of attention right now, which is the screening mode. Uh, this is available on the E95 and T-Series cameras. And how you get to it is you go into your menu set, go into settings, into recording mode, into screening, and this is where you can set up your variance. So allow deviation is 2.5. I'm going to say 2.5 for argument's sake. Um, we're going to get back out of this. And now what you're going to do to set that variance temperature is you'll get whatever um, you're trying to reference. You'll hold in the P button. It's a long hold, just like you would for programming the button. And now you can see that I've set the temperature reset to that, um, to whatever that, that temperature is that it, that it put to. Um, what I can also do is I set up the isotherm on this, something that I like. So in a bubble alarm, and then I put it at 97 degrees. So anything above that 97 degrees, see my hands are not. Something to also consider uh, is the emissivity rating inside of this box. So you would touch into the box, go into your settings, go into the parameters, and make sure that your emissivity is set to what you want it to be uh, for your screening application. If you guys found this video interesting, uh, useful, or if it didn't answer your question whatsoever, um, please leave me a comment down below. I'd love to hear more about uh, your application and how we can better help you uh, train you and your staff uh, on how to use the FLIR thermal camera, uh, E95, and T-Series screening mode. Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Don't forget to visit us at langsales.com and check out what we have available for you there.